Yeah, sometimes the greatest gifts come from little people with big hearts. Take seven-year-old Aiden Burns from Portage County. Tonight, Bob Jones shows us how his idea to help the homeless turn into a huge sock donation. Blessed a lot of people in Akron. I usually go to Bad O'Reilly. Like many boys his age, Aiden Burns loves to play the popular video game Fortnite. Purple's better than all of the colors, but gold. The seven-year-old also has a heart of gold. Because um, I um, like helping others. But that's how he is all the time, though. He's always helping his brothers and worried about other people more than himself. A few months back, Aiden had a chat with his grandma about helping homeless people, and the two brainstormed an idea. A sock drive. I said, um, yes, so we started to collect the socks. Aiden's uncle also created a Facebook page, Socks from Santa, and the Wyndham community stepped up. We got people um, at my school to know about it, and um, my friends on my basketball team. A bunch of brand new socks with stripes, polka dots, black ones, white ones, and just about every other color. And when the counting was completed, there were more than 3,000 pairs of socks, around 300 pounds worth. We were so shocked at the number of socks. Last week, the socks were loaded onto a pickup truck and delivered to the Haven of Rest Ministries in Akron, the largest donation of socks the shelter has ever received, and among the most needed items for the homeless, especially in the winter. To see a seven-year-old thinking about something of that magnitude uh, was just an enormous blessing of, for us. How much of a difference did Aiden make? Normally, someone staying at the Haven of Rest can pick up about two pairs of socks. But because of the boy's generous donation, that number now stands at eight pairs of socks. For Aiden's dad, the sock drive was a major proud dad moment. That just life lessons of putting others in front of yourself. I mean, it's a great thing and something that uh, a lesson that we hope that we can instill in others as well. And the first grader who wears Minecraft socks and is still learning to tie his shoes says he isn't done giving. Do you think this is something you would want to do again? Yeah. <laughs> you do? <laughs> if a seven-year-old can do it, then, you know, anybody can do it. In Akron, Bob Jones, News 5.